In this video, we will learn to parse a web page and extract links from it. We can use request library to download the pages in Python. The request library has different type of requests. We are going to use the get request and we will also use beautiful soup library in Python, which is used for web scraping. It has method for extracting the data we needed from a web page. To use the request and beautiful soup functionality in our script, we must import these two libraries using the import statement. We are going to see an example of parsing a web page. So first we need to add this module to our ID. If you are using a, a command line, you can, you can use command pip install request module so and you can do the same for a beautiful soup i'm going to add through my id so in my id i'm just gonna go to my projects and then over here setting here And over here under the project, click on project interpreter. Here you can add the module you want to include. I'm gonna do request. Then select this one and install package. It will install the request module for us. Search for beautiful soap and already have beautiful soap. Now install this one. Now we have package beautiful soap installed successfully. We can import module in our script. Let's close these windows. Import. Requests module request and we can also import BS for import beautiful soup BS for Now we are going to call requests modules get method to get the page web page. I will give URL of network scademy. And it will really turn us a page object. I'm gonna, I will save in page variable. And now we can create beautiful soup object and save in a variable b soup beautiful soup here we need to pass the first argument as a page content we have in our page object and then is property content this is the content the HTML content that we need to parse and the second parameter we can pass it will be HTML dot parser it is the parser that we want to use to parse this page. So we are going to use HTML parser. And now we are going to find the links in this. I'm going to call B soup. And we are going to call this method find all. 
and give it a for the length here is p and it will return us a link or list of links so i'm gonna save it in a variable list variable and give it a name links list links underscore list loop through our link list for link in links list and we can check if there is href attribute in link dot attributes if we have link attribute in our link that we get from our link list then we can do then we can just go ahead and print our link by converting into a string and give it link dot attributes and then the href tag href and then i'm just gonna do print it off a new line so over here we are printing the link now we can run this program and see if it prints the links you can see it printed the links from our web page these are the links so we can use request module from python and beautiful soup library and we can get the web page content and just parse it with beautiful soup and print out the links for more videos please subscribe to our channel thank you